I didn't think this was necessary, but I now find it to be pretty useful. So I've selected a few of the questions you guys have asked me since I started my YouTube channel and uh, I'm gonna answer them right now. First question. Do you also speak Italian? <laughs> this is a very funny one. I actually am Italian. The Italian language is my native one and I'm also pretty sure that I do sound and look pretty Italian. This helps me introduce the most asked question of all time probably, which is where did you pick up your English? At a certain point of my life I realized that the English language would help me find my way through the world. So I just decided to move to a country where I would speak some English. I moved to London and I was gonna stay there for like a few months because back then I thought that a couple of months would be enough for me to pick up a language. After a couple of months in London I was like yeah I learned some English but you know if I stayed a little longer I would probably learn a little more. So I basically ended up staying there for a couple of years. Once I got back to Italy I thought that I would need to find a way to keep practicing my English. So I joined the Couchsurfing community which you guys probably know about and I started hosting people at my place. I hosted people from everywhere in the world and you know I think I was speaking English pretty much every day. Then I started working on my project and what I do at the moment is just speaking English every day with everyone over Skype and whatever kind of tool. Are you actually Roman? I am not. I'm originally from Avezzano, which is a small little town in Abruzzo. I just lived in Rome for a long time and I love the city. In this video I made a few months ago, you can see the place I'm from. Do you film yourself when you vlog on the street? Yes, I do. I usually hold the camera like this and I film myself vlogging on the street. I try not to care about other people looking at me and, you know, trying to avoid any sort of eye contact and focus on what I'm saying. How did you get your tourist visa for the States? It used to be way harder, but they now made it pretty easy. You just need to have the new electronic passport and a return ticket to whatever you go in. They just need a sort of proof that you live in a country within three months. And then you also need to fill up a form. You can do it online and they will only charge you something like $14. I can't remember exactly. I'll put the link in the down bar. Il Vaso di Pan Dave who I met last week in Rome, he also has a YouTube channel, so you guys might want to check it out, um, asked me, what made you want to start your YouTube channel? I actually haven't started doing what I originally wanted to do on YouTube. Uh, let's say that this YouTube channel for me is just like a test, and that I will be doing something uh, hopefully bigger and more important for me uh, pretty soon. The last question I'm gonna answer is a pretty funny one. How come you travel this often? Where do you get your money from? <laughs> what do you do for a living? <laughs> this is a funny one. Traveling has always been one of my passions. Uh, plus, I've been working on this Meeting Life project for a few years now and I've been traveling ever since to like find people who can help me get it going. In the meantime, I've been doing several different jobs to pay my travels, of course. Also, every time I go somewhere, I always try to find something to do in the place I'm visiting. When I was in LA, I used to make videos for other people. I did Photoshop tutoring for people who wanted to learn how to use Photoshop. I used to teach Italian to people who wanted to learn. And let's just say that I always try to find a way to make some extra cash. Before leaving, I wanted to say hi to Miss Lil Girl who invited me to join her and all the other girls I met in Rome in their shopping tour of the city. And I also wanted to thank Serena who I met that day who gave me her book to read and I'm gonna tell her what I think about it uh, in private as soon as I can. This was my first questions and answers video. I don't know when the next one will be out. Just keep posting your questions below this video and I'll try to make a new one as soon as I have enough. Being my first questions and answers video, it's only gonna be a test. I just wanted to make sure that it wasn't boring, so if you made it until this point, just leave the word ananas in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you very soon.